shop of Ling Tung. I knew I would find you here. Well, that's amazing. How did you know that? You rang gong. <laughs> uh, pardon me, but are you Ling Tung, the great oriental criminologist? Am I Ling Tung, the great oriental criminologist? <laughs> yes, I am Ling Tung. I am lost of Tung family, except, of course, for brother who live in Germany. Perhaps you hear of him, Ak Tung. <laughs> Don't help joke. I think you could use a bigger gong. <laughs> Mr. Tung, I'm a secret agent, Agent 86. And I've been told that you can help me find the Kai Ming Pearl. We drink tea first, talk later. You like American tea or herb tea? I think I'll try the herb tea. All right. Hey, herb! The theft of the Kai Ming Pearl has really got me puzzled. It reminds me a great deal of the Cape Town Diamond case. Now, you may remember that case. The Cape Town Diamond case was, uh, the Cape Town Diamond, you see, was in a vault behind a 10-ton steel door. Well, the thieves couldn't get the door open, so they, they hitched a rope around a Cocker Spaniel, and he yanked the 10-ton door open. One Cocker Spaniel, would you believe it? I don't think so. <laughs> Would you believe two Cocker Spaniels? <laughs> no. What if the thieves used whips? <laughs> How come we're so far from the gong on my joke? <laughs> now, Mr. Tung, do you have any idea who the man is who might have stolen the Kai Ming Pearl? Reminds me very much of Lindy Restaurant Case. Lindy Restaurant Case. I have a feeling we better be moving closer to the gong. Right. <laughs> you see, you recall a woman walking in a restaurant on broad daylight and rob a restaurant a $10,000 payroll. I find that pretty hard to believe. Would you bereave a $5,000 payroll? <laughs> I don't believe so. <laughs> How about a five-cent iron roll? Huh? <laughs> Mr. Tongue, I appreciate your oriental shtick, but... Wait a moment. I have a splendid idea. I take you to, uh... A Japanese nightclub, we question singer there. Her name, Cookie Fortune. <laughs> Cookie Fortune. Is she pretty? <laughs> she a rice cookie! <laughs> hey, she a good looking chick, huh? <laughs> yes, I think I'll question her after the show. You better be careful. Her boyfriend, he karate expert. He'd give you chop on shoulder. Well, if he does that, I'll grab him by the wrist and flip him over my back. Ah! But then he'd grab you by ankle and toss you on floor. Then I'll bounce right up and drive my knee into his stomach. Ah! But well, then he grabbed you by me and throw you out window. You know, I'm having more trouble with you than with her boyfriend. <laughs> Maxwell, you not so smart. Cookie, not take pearl. Chinese poem, tell whole story. Not the 
disappear. Stay in family, always here. Number one son in other world. Find number two son. Find the pearl. Oh. Well, that's amazing, Mr. Tong. Now, just tell me one thing. Where do I find number two son? A repeat question, please. <laughs> <laughs> Where do I find Tucson? Tucson! <laughs>